Gina on a track. What are you doing, KG Squad? Today we are back with another video and another banger for y'all. So y'all need that like, comment, and subscribe button. Yeah. But I've been gone for a while, you know. I've been moving around, you know, living life and going through life. You know what I'm saying? Just, yeah, really going through life. But that's that's besides the point. But I'm back. But as y'all can see, I really don't have that much good equipment right now. Like, I'm using my headphones for a better mic, like. That's down bad, I ain't gonna lie, that's, that's, that's down bad. But I'm trying to bounce back, but I'm gonna still try to get this content out for y'all. But today's video is gonna be a new video. It's gonna be on a different topics, it's gonna be on dreads, you feel me? And I'm basically gonna show y'all how to get y'all dreads like mine. Y'all see them, you know what I'm saying? It's nothing too bad, they look kinda good to me, I feel like. Um, I feel like they look good to me, yeah. You know what I'm saying, they got the little curls in them. You see? But yeah, I'm about to show y'all how to get my hair. So let's get into it. So my first tip to new people who have started locks. Bro, once you get your locks in, protect them mugs at all costs. Do not get them wet, no nothing. Don't use, actually when you first start off, don't use no product in your hair, son. Don't use no product. <laughs> Just leave it. Once your hair is twisted, protect your locks, bro. Cause once you protect your locks, and they actually form like while they like tiny, bro. You gonna be good, bro. You gonna be good. I'm trying to tell you. So don't, don't touch your starter locks, bro. And once your locks get a little bit longer, where you can start like twisting them together, start twisting your hair. That's how I got my little curl patterns. You see? That's how I really got my curl pattern. So you just really gotta just boom. Once your hair get a little bit longer, like. Boom, like this, just twist your hair. Boom. Just twist them together and leave it in. Do not take them out. Leave them in. Do not take your dreads out, bro. Do not take them out. Leave those twists in until you see like new growth like this. You see how like my new growth already coming back? Yeah, you want to see that. And then you can take them out. And then you'll be able to get this curl pattern. Most people who don't have good hair texture like me, you will have to keep doing it a couple times to get the curl pattern. Like, yeah, you're gonna have to keep on twisting your hair, twisting your hair. It's, yeah, I got good hair texture, so yeah, it's just a gift, you know what I'm saying? But I'm about to move on to the next page of this part, you feel me? So basically, you need two products. You need a spray. Oh, that's it. Actually, that's another tip. Whenever you have your starter locks, bro, do not get no gel, no hair growth cream no nothing and rub it between your hair because bro when you have star locks and you have cream and that gel in your hands and you rub it through your hair bro you rubbing your dreads out bro real talk like you you, you rubbing your dreads out you want to at least wait till they get like a little bit longer like like mine but bro like when you get star locks bro do not be taking no growth cream rub it in your scalp don't do that you messing up your your locks bro they gonna start untwisting on you i'm trying to tell you so when you got basically like, like when your hair is like a little bit longer in the starter lock stage and you want to start adding like cream to it, get you a spray. And me, I only use two products, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to put up a picture right here to tell y'all, well to show y'all how short my hair was. Boom, you know what I'm saying? It was short. So basically once my hair got a little bit longer, I used these two products right here. You can't even see this one. I use these two products. I love Miracle Grow Sheen and Stay So Fro. People know what this is, and you should know what this is, but people know what this is. But basically, this is what I do, you know what I'm saying? I couldn't find my headband, but I asked my sister to give me something to hold my hair back, and she gave me this, so don't laugh. So basically, you're just gonna boom, push your dredge back, right? Beautiful nigga, maybe you got rid of that old yee yee ass haircut you got, you get some bitches on your dick. I know Lana exposed, like, oh my God, Lana is terrible. I do not have my brush with me, you feel me? Hold on. Hold on. So I'm back, and this is, yeah, I got my brush, basically. And this is what I do, this is my routine. So just, just follow along, you feel me? Go ahead and roll you something up, you feel me? Do what you gotta do, you know what I'm saying? Eat. But, just eat and watch. Um, so 
Keep brushing. Just keep brushing. You feel me? Ain't nothing to it. I like to make some a lot of Yeah, I know I need a cut for real, but I like to let my my stuff grow. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like if you don't if you don't let your hair grow, what's the point even? You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like if your hair grows back, it's going back healthy and stronger. So you need to take care of it and let it actually grow out a little bit. Boom. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do after that. I just take this off. Boom. Just place my dress like how I want them. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Shake them a little bit. You know, some slight, some slight. And then what I do is I take the first product, the Isle of Miracle, and I just shake it. Look, like, I don't know if y'all can hear it, but that mug is getting low. You know what I'm saying? So I like to do it like to shake it. Get the formula all mixed up, you know what I'm saying? And then I just start from like my crown all the way down, my side, go down, side, go down. You know, just go with the flow of the pattern of your uh, dreads. So let me show y'all. So I just start from here. Boom, spray. Get on the side. Boom, spray. Get on this side. Boom, get the back. You know what I'm saying? Just get everywhere with it. You know? Shake your hair up. You know what I'm saying? Do this way. But I just really like to shake my hair because it's, it's like air drying. You know what I'm saying? Once you do that, and me personally, I like to get my weak side. Y'all can tell this is my weak side because this side isn't like laying down or trained as this side. Like this side is more full. So I'll be getting like a, a little extra layer on this side. Boom. And then I grab my second product, Stay So Fro. Boom, I do the same thing, shake it up. Shake it, get the formula all mixed together. Start from the top, make your way down, stop, make your way down. So, boom. On the side, boom. Get this side. You know what I'm saying? Get the back. Boom, me, I like to get that, my weak side again. So, we're gonna hit that up. And this right here, it really like, it conditions your hair, like it makes your hair like soft. Like it makes like your hair like real soft and it gives your hair that like, like soft texture dress. Cause you don't wanna, want no rough dreads, you know what I'm saying? Cause you definitely do not want that. Boom, you're just gonna shape it like that and then shake it. Just shake it. And look, you can tell like it's starting to get my hair like more volume, like it's starting to like like hang more, it's starting to like thicken up, you know. And then after that, but actually this is a bonus tip. This is a really good bonus tip. If you really want your hair curly like mine, you're gonna have to twist your hair. Like, boom, just take the two ends, twist it, twist it, twist it, twist it. You know, just keep twisting it together. And until like it locks like a two strand. Boom, you see that? Like how it's locking like a two strand? You're gonna wanna do that. And keep that in for like two to three months. Two to three months. And I'm trying to tell you. And use that spray and do rag your hair. Bro, I'm trying to tell you, your hair is gonna it's gonna grow, but it's gonna be healthy. That's what you really want. You want healthy dreads, bro. Because my dread is is healthy. I'm not even gonna lie. Like the healthy you make your dreads, like the faster it grows and like the more like it, it looks better. So definitely try to make your dread as healthy as possible. And once you get your dreads like too strained for a while, they start to become curly. Me, I only had to do this really once. Cause my hair, I have really good hair texture. So they already started to curl up on its own. And that's how they really got 
feel like this. You know what I'm saying? But basically, boom. That's basically the end of the tutorial. I will see my squad later. Love y'all. Got more content coming y'all way that y'all don't even know. But y'all need to like, comment, subscribe. And also leave any cons in the comment section. Like anything I need better. Like I know I definitely need new equipment. But anything like, okay, you need to do this in your videos. You need to do this. Anything that comes to y'all mind, leave it in the comment section below. But besides that, gang, peace. And I love y'all. Squaw. Hey, no man, you act like you ain't seeing it. Ben, I let me find out you a friend of me. Brother, I